I had the idea I could actually use a high pressure water cleaner, ein Hochdruckwasserreiniger. That's this endless all in one German word. That's why we also use the brand's name Kercher, which is shorter. So I thought this high pressure cleaner could be the solution to rinse out all the material, the loose material that is still in the gaps in between of the stones downstairs in the former kitchen. Instead of, you know, using a spatula and scratching it all out, I thought that could be efficient. Turns out in the morning, when I talked to my neighbors Anke and Martin, they had one of those in their workshop, hidden. And I could borrow it. And it was great. I was so fast, like after two hours, the job was basically done. I was completely soaked, of course, and water and the dirt was everywhere, even on my glasses. It was not just me who was getting wet. It was really like the whole space. <laughs> but it doesn't matter because after each rain, the, the water is coming in and it's gathering in the lowest parts where I was excavating the, 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 the soil. And after a few days, it disappears, it dries or disappears through the ground. Then I was directing this solid jet also to the wooden ceiling and later the carpenter told me, oh, that was not such a good thing to do because this ancient wood is quite sensitive and he then later sandblasted it, which I wanted to have done anyway. I uh, was always planning to uh, ask a sandblaster to do all the surfaces, the wooden surfaces. But that's for another chapter later. So I hope I did not too much damage to that uh, ceiling. Is playing with water would have been more pleasurable on a hot summer day, I guess. 
But it was the last days of December, quite the opposite. <laughs> At some places there was still quite hard mortar, so we had to go back using a hammer. And then again, I started the same procedure like on the first floor. I have to prepare first the walls with ordinary cement just to stabilize the stones and also prevent some stones from falling off and eventually also add some stones where there are holes that just seem a little bit too big. And sometimes all of a sudden I just grab a piece of old wood and try to clean it and make it a little bit more even. In a way it's just enjoying the last sun rays in the end of those winter afternoons and to be outdoors after having spent so much time inside in the dark hell <laughs> in the dark and humid hell it really feels like that and it's so far from actually being habitable and how i picture it to be once in the near future Come si vede? Come non si vede? Si vede. Queste parole non ho mai sentito. Io non sapevo che tante alinghieri sapevo questo. 